All right, everybody, this is super fun. Today we have a 2002 Ford T-Bird. So Ford Thunderbird with 47,000 original miles in a very rare color. This is one of the, if not the most desirable color that they produce. In 2002, I believe 2002 was the only year this was produced. I call it kind of a teal. The technical term is Thunderbird Blue. This one has the hard top, which I'm not going to take the hard top off. If you go to our website, familymotorcompany.com, you can see it with the hard top off. You can see it with the convertible top up, with the, uh, the convertible soft top up. It's all in extremely good condition. 47,000 original miles. This has been garaged its whole life. It did spend some time on the East Coast and in Florida. It's been garaged its whole life, though. I'll do all undercarriage. It's really clean underneath. Um, in fact, let's dive underneath right now. So, as minimal corrosion as you'll ever see on a 2002 super clean underneath uh so we're gonna do undercarriage video in the front i mean there's minor 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 not even i wouldn't even call that minor surface corrosion i mean it's a 2002 it's it's in beautiful condition underneath uh, which would be you know an area of concern if it wasn't this type of car the type of person that buys this type of car typically garages it Obviously, barely drove it 47,000 original miles since 2002, and it is pristine. We're going to go through every aspect of this car for you. 3.9 liter V8 engine, just beautiful underneath. It, I mean, it almost looks like a new car underneath. It's got new tires all the way around. It's got beautiful Thunderbird wheels. It's got the leather upholstery. It is the deluxe package. So it's got underneath here, it's got all the uh, clear trim, uh, or excuse me, clear, it's, it's not a bra, what do they call it? Uh, it's basically just keep clear plastic protecting the paint underneath this. So it's obviously probably pretty close to original, so it could use to be replaced. Just a heat gun, it comes up, you put a new one down. Just so that rubber seal isn't sitting directly on the paint. Just keeps everything real nice. The hard top, obviously, extremely desirable. It's in extremely good condition. All the seals are in great shape. The panels on the inside are beautiful. It's got a power tilt telescoping steering wheel. All leather upholstery, power seat. You got a little upholstery wear right here, but no tear or anything. Let's go ahead and flip this forward here. Seat belt's holding it in place there. We'll go ahead and flip this up. You can see the, the Thunderbird logo back there. It's got, I'm gonna put this back in so I don't forget about it. We're gonna pop the trunk here. It has the cover. For when the soft top's down, you want to keep the convertible down. I mean, just look at the condition of every seal on this thing. Every, every inch of the paint on it is near perfection. So there's that cover. It's sitting in the back here. But I think these honestly look the best with the hard top on. Uh, it's my favorite look. It's just a beautiful classic look on a more modern car, which is what they were going for. But all the seals are in excellent condition, says Ford Thunderbird there. All the leather's in great shape on the passenger side. You've got Oh, let's see. This is the tool for loosening these two bolts for the hard top to remove it. And then it's got latches in the rear. It's a pretty simple process. Two people makes, uh, makes it really easy. It'd be a hard to do with just one person, but it's not super heavy. Original window sticker. 
$39,740. I mean, just take into account inflation with only 47,000 miles. I don't have this thing listed for any near, where near what I, I only found one other one on in this color nationwide and maybe you can find another one for me uh most of the time i say something like that it gets me in trouble but it's uh the only one i found nationwide there's one with thirty-two thousand miles on it this has 47 they're asking nearly forty thousand dollars for it there's a couple little scratches here on this piece too um uh, i'm trying to highlight little scuffs and stuff like that because I've had a couple people on YouTube that were like, man, everything you everything you have, you say, is just like in beautiful condition. Well, you know what? I spend seven days a week out searching for this stuff, and then I've got about 30 wholesalers that are just pounding the pavement 24 hours a day to find me stuff like this. I absolutely love it. I pay top dollar for it, but I expect real, real quality, and that's what this is. And that's what you should expect if you actually come out to look at it versus, you know, sitting in the basement messaging on a message board. Uh, you come out to look at this car. You come out to drive this car. You should expect this car to run and drive like it did in 2002 because it does. And it looks amazing. I would say you would be hard-pressed to find another one anywhere out there in better condition than this car. Um, and it's just got all the eyeball in the world. It's one of the coolest looking cars. I'm actually taking it to Cars and Coffee in Sherwood uh, this Saturday, if I can get down there in the morning early enough uh, to get a spot. It's, it's, it's an amazing car. It's a Cars and Coffee type of car. It's super fun. It draws a lot of attention. Top up or top down draws just loads of attention. Go ahead and fire it up here. Forty-seven thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine. So by the time you get here, it will have forty-eight thousand miles on it because I'm gonna drive it a little bit more. I absolutely love it. I enjoy it. It's got ice cold air conditioning. It's got all the fact. Everything's bone stock on this factory stereo system. It's got all the original owner's manuals in there. It's got the, not that you need it, but it's got the informationary guide for taking the top off. Hands-free radio controls, cruise control, power tilt telescoping steering wheel, which is really cool and really nice. And that goes back every time you go to get out. You've got traction control down there, power mirrors, automatic lights so all the modern creature comforts and then you've got the controls here for the power uh soft top which is back behind there so that comes up uh, the the cover that's in the back bolts down right there to cover this up when the hard top's off so the headliner on the hard top's beautiful and all the seals on it are beautiful little storage compartment in here we didn't have this detailed I didn't I didn't see a need to have this car detailed uh, it came in you know just in obviously it was extremely loved by its owners so we've got a uh, pop the hood here and show you the 3.9 liter v8 engine and this engine compartment is just super clean and like I said, this is how it came into us. So there's no point in uh, really having it detailed when it's this clean. The car showcases itself extremely well. Everything was up to date. All the fluids were up to date, but there's not a whole lot to it at uh, it's extremely low mileage. So if you're looking for really the perfect color, beautiful Ford Thunderbird, this might be the right one for you. Thanks for watching.